So today I want to talk about growing peanut butter fruit tree here in Phoenix, Arizona. There's been some discussion lately in some of the Facebook garden groups whether or not these are self-pollinating, and I want to assure you that they are. This tree here is in ground and is 300 foot away from the closest other peanut butter fruit trees at the other side of the property. Peanut butter fruit trees are somewhat of a slower grower. It's a bush here in our area, so they are appropriate for container growing if you do not have space in your yard. We do grow these under 30% shade fabric in the summer. That comes off in the fall, and in the winter we replace it with a 1.5 ounce frost fabric due to our location in South Phoenix. We do frequently get into the mid to high 20s, which would damage the trees. Peanut butter fruit is best when they are picked dark orange, set them on the counter and allow them to ripen for a few days to where they turn red. It's very similar to a Barbados cherry. You want to allow them to get to the darkest color possible before picking them to get the full flavor. At the time of this filming, 43 out of the past 49 days reached over 110. We know that they have no issue whatsoever with the heat. If you have any questions, please ask in our Facebook group, Living the Green Life. Our Instagram page is Seamus underscore O'Leary underscore. YouTube channel is Seamus O'Leary, and our website is greenlifebyshamusoleary.com. We do not offer any mail order service at this time. And if anyone asks me what peanut butter fruit tastes like, you will be blacklisted for life.